uniform motion here uh, the distance traveled by the object with time is shown in the figure if we observe we found that in equal interval of time the interval of time is one second the distance traveled by the object is also equal in the first interval it is covering 10 meter second 10 meter third 10 meter fourth 10 meters and the last also 10 meter so in equal interval of time the distance traveled by the object is equal so this type of motion is known as uniform motion next non-uniform motion in this case the this time interval is equal but the distance covered by the object is not equal in the first interval it is covering one meter second interval it is covering two meter third interval it is covering again one meter fourth interval it covers two meter and in this way we can see that the distance covered by the object is not equal in equal interval of time so when the distance travel is unequal in equal interval of time we say that the object has non-uniform motion now speed the distance traveled by a ob moving object per unit time is expressed by the quantity and it is known as speed so speed tell us how fast an object is moving we can define speed as the distance traveled by the object per unit time and it is expressed by speed is equal to distance travel by time taken the unit of speed is the unit of distance divided by unit of time unit of distance is meter and unit of time is second so unit of speed is meter per second now type of speeds uniform speed here in this figure it is shown that with time the distance is changing and at equal interval of time the interval of time is one second the distance covered by the object is equal 10 meter in all the interval so if a moving body covers equal distance in equal interval of time the speed of the object will be uniform speed non-uniform speed here it is shown with time how the distance is changing in this case the distance covered by the object is not equal one two one so in this way if a body covers unequal distance in equal interval of time the speed of the object is said to be non-uniform speed now usually when i consider any moving object like bus car train etc they do not move with a uniform speed during the whole journey suppose if we consider the case of a bus it starts its journey from a bus stand so first it will move slowly that means and later on the speed increases now if it enters in a crowded road again the speed decreases and when they cross the crowded road the speed again increases that means during the entire journey the speed is increasing decreasing and increasing that means the speed is not constant so in such situation we use another term that is average speed and it is defined as the ratio of the total distance travel by it divided by total time taken by it and this is expressed is this way average speed equal to total distance travel divided by total time taken thank you